Hello everybody, Dead Spikes here. Today I am coming at you with the Borderlands 3 hotfixes for April 30th. We've all been impatiently waiting for this, just wondering what they're going to do today. So today is also the end of a very good event they had running. So I will just be simply reading the whole hotfix for you guys. So you can do whatever you want while listening to it. If you would like to read it yourself, it will be in the pinned comment down below. Let's get right into it. Today we will release a hotfix for Borderlands 3, which will be live on all platforms by 12 p.m. PST. In this week's hotfixes, Loot the Universe starts on Promethea, and we address drop rates in Mayhem mode and concerns reported by the community. Woohoo! To apply hotfixes, wait at the main menu until you see a sign that says hotfixes applied. Thank you to everyone who has already jumped into Revenge of the Cartels and experimented with Mayhem 2.0. We've been closely monitoring feedback and we are aware of some stability issues and concerns as a result of the April 23 patch. Since then, we've released additional hotfixes to temporarily disable two resource intensive Mayhem modifiers. Boundary and Drone Ranger. I don't really know what those are and have already been substantial improvements to performance and stability. We are continuing, continuing to focus our efforts on addressing your concerns. Today's adjustments to drop rates and anointment rates are another step toward incorporating community feedback. If you are experiencing any issues or want to provide additional feedback, please submit a ticket to support.2k.com. The co-op loot drop events today ends today at 9 a.m pt that is sad that was a really awesome event i tested it out myself a little bit there was a lot of loot dropping so it's sad to see it go i was hoping maybe it was a permanent thing but not this time around the loot the universe mini event is moving across the galaxy to promethea jump onto the planet until may 7th at 9 a.m pt when it changes to eden 6. and here's the adjustments they made with uh mayhem mode Adjusted the drop rate for legendary items in mayhem mode. Adjusted the drop rate for anointed gear in mayhem mode. Activated the loot the universe event on Promethea. Lowered the OPQ system's secondary rate of fire to prevent stability concerns due to the gunner's ability to spawn an excessive amount of drones. Addressed a reported concern that badass enemies in the Guns Love and Tentacles DLC were sometimes only drop in common and rare items. Addressed a reported progression blocker that could sometimes occur when enemies would fail to spawn during Protect the Nimble Namicon. Addressed a reported concern that the Amorites would stand up and float when being defeated with the dominant status effect during the Horror in the Woods. Addressed a reported stuck spot behind the wooden wall during the shadow of Curse Haven. Addressed a reported stuck spot on the pipes during the Nibble Domicon. Addressed a reported stuck spot on the right of the Amaret camp wall during the horror in the woods. Reduced the time between Mox, ta Mox Tales donations on the Echo Cast from 60 seconds to 30 seconds. If you've noticed a potential concern that has affected you that is not addressed in this update, please send us your data. Many factors are at work and collecting info from a variety of folks can go a long way to help us find commonalities. Identify the root cause and address confirmed issues. The best way to get us your data would be to open a support ticket and include the following information. Summary of the issue, frequency of the issue, the platform you're playing on, your game state when the, you experience the issue. Do you know the steps to make this problem happen again? All right. Send support tickets to help them out. Um, I must say this is a pretty awesome hotfix. I am very excited. It means that more legendaries are going to drop from Mayhem. A lot of people have came to my Twitch chat complaining that they can't get a lot of legendaries in Mayhem mode. They tell me it's dropping better in Mayhem 6 than in Mayhem 10 is pretty insane so i'm glad they addressed it and hopefully it is better for everyone more anointed gear more legendaries i'm pretty excited i'm gonna go be checking out promethea today in the stream make sure you're subscribed to the channel for some more content like this stop by the stream if you would like it's in the pinned comment down below i hope you all have a wonderful day let me know what you think of the update 
Spikes out.